This is Snake. Do you read me? Loud and clear. Glad to see you landed safely. I got blown pretty far off target. Snake, let's go over your mission objectives one more time. Oh, that looked very spaceshipy. Rescue Sokolov. Find Wait. out what's happened to the Shagahod, then destroy it. And finally, eliminate the bot. I mean, they weren't working on it before then. Just this mission will be codenamed Operation to Snakey. Or? Because I'll be taking on the boss and her Cobra unit, right? Don't forget about Colonel Volkin. I'm not a hired killer. I know, but that was the I'm trying to look at things. Demand? You mean it wasn't just a request? <laughs> what's it to us if the Khrushchev regime is threatened by the Colonel and his faction? If supporting the current regime helps us avoid a nuclear exchange, then that's what we'll do. And what are the CIA's demands? Our priorities are the rescue of Sokolov and the destruction of the Shagahod. Roger that, Major Tom. Hold on, Snake. <laughs> what now? Sounds I'm changing fun. my code name. It turns out Tom wasn't the most auspicious choice. What do you mean? Well, the truth is, when I chose my code name, I picked the wrong one. The wrong one? Did you ever see the movie The Great Escape? It came out last year. Mm, I must have missed that one. <laughs> anyway. It's based on a true story about prisoners who escaped from a POW camp in Nazi Germany. The prisoners dig three tunnels as part of their plan, but the Nazis find two of the tunnels before they're finished. The prisoners succeed in escaping by using the last remaining tunnel. The names of those three tunnels were Dick, Harry, and Tom. I get it. You used the name of the tunnel they escaped in as your code name because you thought it would bring you good luck. Yes, that's exactly right. At least, that was the plan. But? But I got the name wrong. The one they escaped in was Harry. Tom was one of the unlucky tunnels. It was discovered by the Nazis before it was finished. I watched the movie again just to make sure. In fact, I even ordered the actual film from the movie company. Yeah, it doesn't sound like the greatest name to use. So what should I call you? Hmm. You know, let's just use Zero, like we've been doing all along. All right, then. Major Zero it is. We'll start over from square one. From square zero. My frequency is 140.85. Okay. I'm surprised oh, it's not zero, 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 zero. Once again on this mission. Is this her last chance too? If we fail, she'll have her medical license revoked. It's more or less the same kind of fate. So. Her frequency is the same as during the virtuous mission. 145.73. She'll be recording your mission data as well, just like the last one. That frequency is also the same. <laughs> yeah. One it's night time now. I wasn't sure if it was in the game or across There's the one street. One more person on your support team. <laughs> His name is Mr. Sigurd. He's an expert on the latest in weapons and equipment technology. You'll be going up against some of the world's most advanced weaponry when you infiltrate the research facility. If you have any questions, just ask him. His frequency is 148.41. Mr. Sigurd, got it. Adam, your KGB contact, is waiting for you at the abandoned factory up ahead. The same factory Sokolov was being held in last week. Yes, meet up with Adam first. He's cleared the way for you to rescue Sokolov. How will I know this Adam guy when I see him? You'll know once you reach the factory. The whole area's been polluted by the fallout from that nuclear blast. No one else would dare come close. The password is, Who are the Patriots? And Lali Lule Lo. Lali Lule Lo. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> You've been equipped with a 45 for this mission. Be careful, it's noisy. I thought standard Fox procedure was procure on site weapons acquisition. The circumstances are different this time. You're now on an official mission for the United States government. It would be necessary to make your presence known to a certain extent, to the Khrushchev regime at the very least. But remember, this is still a sneaking mission. But be as loud as you want to be. If you fail this mission, it will mean an all out nuclear war. Allowed that in mind and proceed with extreme caution. Understood. Commencing Operation Snake Eater. Oh man, they said the thing. Oh. Wait. Do I immediately go into the part with the pawns? Have, or... have what? You have no paint. No paint. No paint. No paint. I can do this. That doesn't seem probably will. <laughs> I think that'd be oh, more like obnoxious. I mean, right. black and woodland would do good for you right now. That relief would do well. 
Well, so you mean you in, the, in the face? Yeah. Or the wood one? Oh, I'm not gonna change it to leaf. No. Oh, okay. I think that gave you 10 plus camo. Oh, there are still people around. Yep. There's a horse. Yep. Oh. You're right, that guy does get me. Well, he just had no like his knife. Weird. It looks like it's duct taped to his leg. It legitimately looks like it's you duct taped. Don't probably have to crawl. You just told me those people. Was <laughs> it not? So? <laughs> well, we gotta crawl. No, you don't. People like crawling. Okay, so. Do I not remember where things were from last time? No, it's my time now. Everything's changed. Oh, Everything's I hate it when that happens. Out. Only when it rains. Mm -hmm. Ah, ha, ah, ah. ha. Oh, horse? Oh, horse. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Why? You don't think this would be horses? That guy with the spurs had spurs, so it implies that he has a horse. <laughs> so. For, for a second it looked like his knife was duct taped to his leg. <laughs> kind of does. Seems suspicious. Looks like death wasn't ready for you yet. Oh no. I mean, Snake. The last time you tried to take one, he broke you arm and broke your gun. That arm still hurt. What are you doing here? Oh no. He's Black Widow now. Pretty sus he came before Black Widow. Wow. Stop breaking my guns. I need I'm those. Anyway. Yeah. Go home. Blue and my sons are waiting up ahead. Your thumbs? You don't have a prayer of finishing your mission. You're not even armed. I have two arms, thank you. Didn't you notice I was wearing a bandana? I'm not your boss anymore. There's nothing for you here. Go home. Go back to your boss. Oh. There's no need to I want that thing. You're virtuous here. <laughs> this isn't America. I don't think that's out. Okay. How's he supposed to go back home if you blow up his rocket? Mm -hmm. Well, people are gonna know where you are now. That should stir things up a bit. You'd better hurry. Is there gonna be an R1? Yep, there it is. Oh. The border is 60 miles south of here. You ought to be able to run that far. Why'd you defect? I didn't. I'm loyal to the end, to my purpose. Mm. What about you, Jack? Hmm. You're loyal to the end. What's it going to be? Loyalty to yep. your country or loyalty to me? Your country or your old mentor? The mission or your beliefs? Your duty to your unit or your personal feelings? Where did that even come from? Know the truth yet. But sooner or later you'll have to choose. The pocket 
Poncho. I don't expect you to believe me. But you can't defeat me either. You know me too well. Just look at that bandana. If you can't put the past behind you, you won't survive long. If we meet again, I'll kill you. Ow. Now, go home. How am I supposed to do about that? This Hero, is she stepped on my hand. Major Zero. I read you, Snake. I was ambushed by the boss. You were what? The drone's been shot to hell. It's up in flames. That's not good. Enemy scouts are going to come looking for you. Yeah, I know. But what was the boss doing here in the first place? There's got to be a leak somewhere. No, that's impossible. The man the boss is working with, Volgin, isn't exactly on speaking terms with Kutcher. I lost my gun. The boss destroyed it. Again. Snake, I know how you're feeling. It's hard for me to believe, too, that a legendary hero like the boss would go over to the Russians. That you'd double-cross us like this. But that's how it is, and if you don't accept it, you'll never be able to beat her. That's not the problem. In terms of sheer technique, I'll never be able to beat her. I know that all too well. You've got to do it, Snake. She's your enemy and your objective. Enemy? We were together for ten years, and now you tell me she's my enemy? Enough. Hurry to the factory where Adam is waiting. Scouts have probably already been sent out to investigate the explosion. You've lost your weapon, right? That means you've got no chance of winning in a battle situation. Whatever Thanks. you do, don't let them see you. No, all of a sudden you're back to sneaking. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I was wondering why you were just running around like that. I didn't realize they were right there. <laughs> well, they, he said that people come and do it, you know, investigate the explosion. Oh, no, it's too. Reinforcements. You might want to go back into the glass. Yeah. There we go. I like how the... that help oh yeah look at that grass I really wanna I know I have a uh... I can use the most and attack though that's so you will they are but it also so you will like snakes and frogs and anything else that's moving is yeah. can I pick up like fucking night vision goggles or whatever the fuck that Thermal the goggles? Do I have to find them again? Probably. Here's a bitch. Oh, a mini map. Also has a battery, so pay attention to that too. If it has a battery, then I probably don't actually need to use it right now. This is gonna be some riveting gameplay. Maybe <laughs> people at home. Oh. 
What do you got in your weapons? Oh, you got stun grenades and a knife. A uh, microphone. Yeah, that'll tell you where things are. Big ass piece of grass. It's done nothing for me. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything about my broken hand. I don't know, go to the thing and check out the queue if there's any thing you need to do for it. No? Apparently not. Not both, I guess do it. A fucking horse stepped on it. I think it'd be broken. Eh. Nah. This random droid just blew up. I don't know how it got here or what happened to it, but there's no problems detected. Must be aliens. Usually it's aliens, yeah. So there's one guy. Hmm. It's one guy. Well, we'll yeah. take him out. Maybe you can question him. Maybe. Waiting for him to, like, not be facing me. Yeah, you gotta sneak up behind him and grab him. Yeah. You gotta hold the button. The square button? Whatever button it is to hold them. And then I, I think you press triangle to like press them. Okay, I'm just gonna go triangle then. I think it might be square to hold them, yeah. I don't remember. <laughs> no, it's square to stab in the ankle. Yeah. That's why I said crawling's not always the best. All the time. There you go, just need one more stab. Got anything That's you can pick up? That's not what I wanted to do. X, X. Probably should have brought him to the. Um, I was going to, but quest. I got scared. Okay. You also gotta heal yourself again. All better. Yeah. <laughs> Makes a lot of sense, but yeah, I need to cure my hand. Yeah. Oh, why does no? Put your knife away. Oh, it's that's the other button. Nope, there they are. Well. <laughs> I probably should put him down. You know. <laughs> Use some stun grenades for me too. Uh, uh, did that guy suit that other guy? Oh, I stabbed him. Oh, did you... oh okay. Because it didn't look like you were even close enough to stab him. There are no enemies. There was nothing here.
fuck are you shooting at? Yep, those are some dead people, alright. You'd think I'd be able to take their guns. Hey. You see me? I'm glad it takes one stab. That's the money. I see them. Is that him? I see him. God damn it. Hey, what are we doing? What? <laughs> I'm concerned that you inside him. Um. Half hours. That was okay. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. Hope so. Oh, he oh. <laughs> shot me right in the. <laughs> mm. Yep. He's suffering, all right. <laughs> that's an. Un yeah. That's an unfortunate spot. I mean, it could be worse. It could be lower. You know, any special ones? I guess, yeah. That's okay. I'm not awake enough to the thing. Though. You need a knife. Oh. I don't know why I want to put a knife there. <laughs> There's a guy there, and then he just. Well, you gotta dig the blade out. The sides. But it's in. Well, they're not questioning anybody, I guess. I thought I heard someone else. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> yeah. Or are there more? I need healing. Oh, I'll take it that game tomorrow. Not healing health. You know we need food. Doesn't really make sense. What the fuck am I supposed to use? No, first heal yourself. Oh, that's worse. <laughs> that's exactly where you don't want like... it to be. I oh. Yeah, they really like suiting you. you oh. know what mm. <laughs> How do you put a band-aid on that? Carefully. Very carefully. <laughs> oh, I, don't I thought that would heal me. It didn't do anything for your health. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. I want some more. I have to go back. Do I have? You don't have the life thing. Son of a bitch, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Just lay down on the ground. You'll be fine. That's what you're looking for. You pretend to die, I guess. Use it in here. I don't know. I wouldn't. I don't know. Wouldn't use it. How many revival pills do you have? I don't know.
none, apparently. No, I, I have one. Oh, it doesn't tell me how many I have. I only one, that. apparently. Neat. So I want <laughs> I don't know if I'd use that. I... Is this working? Yeah. Just your health was that low. Can you guys run out of bullets yet? Why don't you shoot your dead guy? This dead guy here. Alright, go get him. I'll use the stun grenade. Probably stun grenade. Over there? I see him. That's what I wanted. <laughs> That's gonna help a lot. Now, what a way. Guess go to the next area. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I'm gonna just stab the guy. Just go to the next area. Don't worry about them. Where's the next area? I just came into an area. Oh. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for coming up and shooting my body. <laughs> Wanted to make sure so you were dead. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> Special grass. You're not who I wanted to talk to. <laughs> Paramedic. Snake, it's so good to hear from you again. To me either. It's been a week, hasn't it? Four days, actually. I visited you in the hospital. You were still unconscious then. I wanted to save the game. Uh, then you must have seen me naked. Yeah, but you were all wrapped up in bandages and tubes, so I couldn't do anything but look. Better luck next time. Mm. Oh my. Oh. But seriously, don't forget that you were like that until just yesterday. In fact, you really shouldn't even be on this mission. Keep an eye on your stamina gauge. If you start to run low, don't push yourself. Eat something to replenish your stamina. And try not to get yourself hurt. If you're wounded or get bitten by a venomous animal, go into the survival viewer immediately and treat yourself using Thanks. cure. Yeah, yeah. I can see you still know how to nag. You're welcome. And I can see you still don't know when to keep your mouth shut. <coughs> Maybe so. By the way, I heard you're going to lose your medical license if this mission fails. Yes, there was talk of that. But the mission won't fail, will it? Of course not. Good. I believe in you. But you know what? I really don't care about your medical license. Didn't they use that to force you to participate in this operation? No, I volunteered. Why? So that I could watch over you. <clears throat> Snake, you're the best agent I've ever seen. But you push yourself too hard. You're reckless. Someone has to stop you from getting into trouble. To make sure you and the boss don't kill each other. I'm glad I get th this entire so conversation before being allowed to save. I mean, you couldn't ask for a better guardian <laughs> angel than me, right? Thanks. Stop right there. Huh? You can thank me when you get back. All right. Oh my. Okay, good luck, Snake. Thanks. Oh, wow, she didn't say anything about a movie. Wow. <laughs>